Well, folks, we're fixing to do an evening squirrel hunt, and uh, I'm down here with uh, one of our sponsors, Mr. Kenny Anglin with the Critter Getter, and uh, we're here with Jeremy Carter, and of course we got Mud Duck and myself, and what county we in, Jeremy? Treatland County. Treatland County, and we got the dogs here, and got some more guys here that's going to go with us, and we're going to see if we can find us a bushy tail or two, but uh, Kenny, what do you, what do you got in all this stuff here? This is my turkey bag, but we, we're squirrel hunt. <laughs> you sure? Uh-huh. But you said uh, we've seen turkeys. Well, that might be a turkey dog. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure it is. That's why we got mud duck. Well, folks, we're, we just now got here, just pulled in, and just throwed us on some rubber boots, and we're going to head out. So y'all stay tuned. You're watching Extreme Christian Outdoors. Ready when y'all are. All right, y'all need to. I need to get some of the keys out. You want to? Daddy's gonna have to forward her now if y'all need yeah, to you know, with cameras or anything like that. Wanna kind of keep need a rider. I'm, I'm gonna put anything on. He's gonna ride the roof. I only got two shells. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, Well, I'll turn Kenny loose here in a minute. I still brought y'all down the got it on the leash, thank you. He brought him for back here. These poor dogs go late for his house. I had 100 yards. 100 yards for me? Yeah. He's picking up for us. They treat now. They treat now. They barking, running. Did you do that, Kenny? <laughs> I reckon. You gonna, you gonna that? That was a 20-gauge, buddy. He got it. Well, that dirt's still alive, buddy. Now, y'all can hear it if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he got his mouth on that limb. I'm ready to use it. Are you moving right now? Let him get a shot with the camera. Tell him right here, he's about to get him, buddy. Yeah, he's getting good on this side. Oh, dead eye. I don't know what y'all eat with it. Didn't even tell you what. Not that toy gun. Shoot that toy gun. Yeah. Oh, it's hot. You think it'll wax on the ears? Don't tell what's got the sound in it. Get down, get down. 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 Climbing. Oh, I'll shoot him if you want to. Go for it. 
You want to get it back? Yeah. What was you eating? Jeremy he took his dag on walkie-talkie away from him. Hey, he ain't got one. <laughs> He's walkie-talkie. <laughs> Three hundred yards, Rod. I got my back behind some measures. We're gonna put a worker, we're gonna treat at least five or more. I ain't seen the two. That's the only thing you count, that's the only thing you can eat at. That's right. <laughs> you can't eat them wannabes. Yeah, that's what it's doing. That's what you're moving. Yeah, he's over yonder, y'all. Going out. Going out. That's where the dogs are moving. He's That's what you're doing. He's there at the top of the tree. That's kind of the top of the tree. See him? See him going around the tree? Yeah. Is he on this tree right here? Yeah. I don't think he made that other tree. You see him moving too. Yeah, let me get up here because I can. He's probably, he's probably coming back down the tree, y'all. Yeah, he could be in that tree over yonder. I see him. Yeah? He's up there on the limb. All right, go ahead, Eddie. Shoot. Feel free? Awesome. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. <laughs> He's hanging up there. He's hanging? Yeah, see him again. Knock him out. You see him better on that side, Jeff? I don't see him. I don't see him. He's got him on the back side. I got him right here. Hey, you see him on that side? He's sitting right here on his limb. Where's that? Where's that, Oscar? What? Double shot. Oh, hey, that's all hey, it took, huh? <laughs> 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 Yeah. Just look at it. 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 I've seen no squirrel. Hey! Hey! Yeah. Buddy, everybody hunting you. Everybody hunting my buddy. He ready, ain't he? Yeah, he's ready. <laughs> Gonna kiss it now? <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Let one and shoot the other one. He's right. He's right in the top. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Everybody ready? We ready. Take. <laughs> well, that's a double, isn't that? That was a double. <laughs> right to, to, uh, about to go down. Can you hear that? <laughs> what biscuit? No, oh, listen. Yeah. Longhorn, Longhorn, and Phillips are buying. Or Kenny. I think Kenny is. He's hollering down there. Okay. So, well, folks, we've had fun. We're gonna hunt on out to the truck. I think in the morning we may try to do some rabbit hunting. All depends on the weather tonight. 
Or we might go back out for some squirrels first thing. It all depends what the weather does. So, yep. y'all stay tuned. You're watching Extreme Christian Outdoors. We're with Mr. Kenny Anglin with Critter Gitter. And uh, if he takes good care of us, we'll be back in the morning. Y'all stay tuned. Yep. Kenny, why are you huffing and puffing so much for all of Man, we have walked and walked. Oh, last time I seen you, you was on a golf cart. Well, I can't tell Oscar, everything. you got to ride on a golf cart on this trip oh, at all. Know. Every time I would look, that Kenny's on. <laughs> and who else? Well, the camera guy. And where do they work? For the state. <laughs> Enough said. But who killed yeah. all the squirrels? Who killed the first squirrel? I'll, leave, I'll let that go. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Oh, is that the one you shot with the dummy shell? No that's shot right, in it? That's okay. Right. <laughs> well, folks, we've had a great time. Uh, we've hunted the dark, and we got the dogs loaded back up. Got a few squirrels tonight. We're fixing to have them get something to eat. And what's the game plan for in the morning, Jeremy? We'll try to do a little rabbit hunting or squirrel hunting. Just go to the weather. Rabbit hunting or squirrel hunting. Go what the weather does. Well, good deal. We, we've tried Kenny out on quail before. He's a pretty good pointer. I don't know how he's going to do on rabbits. <laughs> so. Folks, hope y'all enjoying the show. Just stay tuned. You're watching Extreme Christian Outdoors, and we're down here in what county are we in again? Fruitland County. Fruitland County. Y'all stay tuned. We'll be right back. Well, folks, it's raining. Uh, we're fixing to leave the motel, go get us some breakfast. Hopefully, the rain is going to quit here in another hour or two, and uh, I think we're going to try to run some rabbits, or we may go back squirrel hunting. I uh, don't really know. We're going to go hunt for something if it quits raining. But right now, I think, I'm sure we're going to go hunt for some food. Biscuit. Biscuits. So we can pretty much find one of them. There. We got proof of that. Yep. So where's Critter Getter at? He's over here asleep. Over here? Oh, corner. that's that racket I heard over in the corner. Well, folks, he don't snore a bit. Unless he's by himself or with somebody. <laughs> Y'all stay tuned. We'll be right back. Kenny left his boots out in the back of his truck last night. And it rained all night. Now, they are rubber boots. And they, he don't think they'll leak. But they were standing up, they right? They were standing up. Kenny. Sir. Explain. <laughs> well, they were muddy. And I thought I'd wash Inside? them off. Inside? I just thought I'd wash them off. <laughs> he wasn't thinking. He wasn't thinking, trust me. That's probably true. <laughs> you know him like we do? He was not thinking. I was hungry. He was hungry. <laughs> hungry. <laughs> Folks, we're out here uh, getting uh, started on a little rabbit hunt. Oh, Jeff, you ready, ain't you? I'm ready. What, what happened? Uh, I thought Phillips was supposed to be shooting today. He said something about you couldn't run the camera. That's what he said. Have you lost, forgot how? I hope so. <laughs> I don't guess I'll have to run it no more. I'll get shoot all the time. <laughs> there now. you go. Hey, there I didn't go. think about that. It might work in our advantage. Yeah, it might. Looks, no, I tell you what it was. I feel it pretty smart. Yeah. The camera don't weigh you near as much as the shotgun yeah. does. That's true. How yeah. you're getting that's the picture. Right. You don't get laughed at that's, near as much as right. you miss. That's right. Now yeah. the rain's quit, so. Well, the dogs are running on down this way, so we better go so we can catch up with old Cottontail. Yep, yep, looks like he's running. Yep. Hey, Oscar, you want me to cut you a stick so you can point? <laughs> you carry this thing to fire. We're at the bugs. You point, you point it. It has a shell in it. It has a trigger. <laughs> you pull it. I don't know what we're going to do about Bugs Bunny. He got away. Now he's telling his stories now, eh? He just points. <laughs> so, Oscar, we heard Kenny's version. What's your version? <laughs> I saw a wabbit. That's all I can tell you. And he was moving faster than I was moving. <laughs> That's a true pointer right there. And yeah, that just getting to go in the brush after it. Oh, he will in a minute. Come on, Tally Ho, Tally Ho, Tally Ho, Tally Ho, Tally Ho, Tally Ho. Where'd y'all see the rabbit cross that? Tallaho, 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 Tallaho. Tallaho, 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 Tallaho. 
world to shoot because you got you got Oscar that goes he ain't gonna shoot you got Jeff but don't even have no bullets you'll be in good shape So why did they put the pan on the tree? It's a turpentine tree. They had skinned it down with the axe and this here dripped down with the turpentine into the cup. Most of them you see is a tin cup. So they had started at the bottom and worked the tree up. Most of them got three faces on them. If you notice these trees over here got three faces on them. When you cut the timber, they send this here to make perfume and dynamite out of the big, uh, big, uh, fat lighter. I've seen some women before that, that smelled like perfume that was dynamite. <laughs> that was dynamite, huh? <laughs> they mean. <laughs> they blow up like dynamite and hurt you. Yeah, there's a metal cut right there. <laughs> I got a bone pick with you. All right, go ahead. I noticed when we went in the mud, I, why did I have to go first? In case your shovel leg got stuck, if four wheel drive, I'd hook you up to this two wheel drive and pulled you right on out. Well, yeah, you could look at it like that, but I was thinking like this. I could just push you out of the way. If you got in there, you might have pushed me when you slid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I figured. But see, if you'd been behind us, we never would have known if we left you behind. That's why we let you go first. Well, if I got behind you, I'd have just pulled you out backwards. You weren't going to get stuck. <laughs> don't worry. Stuck. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Well, Ain't no problem. I don't know. Three hundred. I tell you what, y'all just get behind me going home, okay. and as far as we can go, I knock the wind off so y'all stay up with me. Well, I like to go to church tomorrow, so I'm gonna be in front. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, I guess that's good enough. <laughs> well, guys, we finished up a day and a half of hunting. I've had a great time. What about you, Oscar? I have, really have. Now, Kenny, I, 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 I got to know something. Okay. I tell everybody else had on rubber boots, and you didn't wear your rubber boots, see them. <laughs> well, they, mine got wet. How'd they get wet? They got on the back of my truck last night, and it rained. And uh, I'm not really sure I left them on the back, but they said I did. So. That's where they was at this morning. <laughs> That's <laughs> where they were. They were there this morning. You got right. Well, who, who did, I mean, you said something about... The he old, hear good. He old mud duck. Yeah. I, I asked Oscar if he'd mind getting them off my truck for me, but he did. What do you want me to do with them? Put them in the back of your truck. You had a camper. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have room, did we? No, we didn't have room. We had Philip's snacks in there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah Philip room. had all his snacks. That's right. That's the camera guy. Well, Kenny, we've had a great time down here. We enjoyed it. Enjoyed it. Uh, we've done some rabbit hunting, some squirrel hunting down here, folks, and we're fixing to have to head back north. But uh, made some new friends, and we got some plans for the future to do some more hunting. I think these guys are going to come up to the mountains, and we're going to do some squirrel hunting and rabbit hunting up there. So y'all stay tuned. You're watching Extreme Christian Outdoors. And remember, take your family to church somewhere this Sunday. See you next week, same time. May God bless. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed today's hunt. Uh, we took a little weekend with one of our sponsors, Critter Getter Game Calls, Mr. Kenny Anglin. And we went and done a little small game hunting with some squirrel hunting, some rabbit hunting. Most of all, we had some great fellowship, great time, and most of all, we ate some great food. We like to eat every time we go out. We just had a good time, just enjoyed God's creation. Right now, we've just finished our 2014 Extreme Boys Camp uh, for the season. Uh, waiting on, we're going to do family night tonight where the family's coming and picks them up. We hope they come and pick them up. We've had them all week and we're going to feed everybody and share with them what we've done this week. Our theme this week was temptation. And that's what we talked to the boys about, uh, things we're tempted with in life and, you know, temptations and decoys. You've heard me talk about decoys before, but, you know, Satan and the world, they use decoys to, to intrigue us and make us think something looks better than what it really is. And, 
You know, my daddy always told me if things look so too good to be true, sometimes that's the truth. So we need to be careful what we're getting into, what we're doing, and just take this a moment, just slow down and think. You know, there's an old saying we've heard years ago. Those bracelets. I know Mr. Matt he talked to the boys about this this week about WWJD. What would Jesus do? And one of the things I usually try to always go by, well, whatever you're doing in life, whatever you're doing at the moment. Whatever you're involved in, is this something you could do if Jesus was a sitting there right with you? Or what if he showed up? And if it's not nothing you want him to be there with or, or him to show up, you might not ought to be doing it. So this is something to think about. We're life's full of temptations. So I encourage you, seek the Lord, go to him in prayer, study his word, and just try to spend time with him each day. It'll make you have a better life, I promise you. Until next week, join us same time, same place. May God bless.